Now we have this bed coming out of water. A new one is going in. Tomatoes, peppers, cucumber. Uh, it's self-running. Uh, it's all natural. Uh, it works in the harmony with fish as well. So we have a fish tank. Water will go from the uh, fish tank to the plants, come back and go back to the fish tank. And we don't add any chemicals, any synthetic or whatever, no natural, uh, only we add iron uh, because plants need iron. Uh, uh, this machine is based on aquaponic system, where basically uh, the fish is the main provider of nutrients for the plants. So basically the feces of the fish will be providing a, a natural fertilizer for plants and plants will be acting as a natural biofilter. So they will actually clean the water so the water can go back to the fish tank. And like that goes in a circle. The big machine will give in within one month, 120 to 140 kilos of rucola, or it will nurture in the same time frame within a month, about 650 lettuce heads. And at that time, it will consume more or less about 15 euros in electricity cost. It can be implemented not only on aerated agricultural land, but this is the beauty of it that can be done. We can go in the industrial areas, we can even go indoor. Hopes in future is to see many more greenhouses filled with our technology, growing healthy greens and healthy fish. We struggled a bit on our road, I must admit. Uh, one of the main obstacles is financing. Uh, to finance setup of the pilot farm. I understand with any innov innovation, something new, it's hard to get your message through. People might not see it and understand, have vision that we have. And we are hoping now that we are getting support from, the, from other institutions that are uh, enabling us to tap into grants and schemes offered on national level or European level. So that's what we are hoping for.